hello everyone and very welcome to the channel in this video we are going to have a look at another text to speech and speech to text model family called as Celero. Celero models are pre-trained enterprise grade STT and TTS models which are refreshingly simple they provide quality comparable to Google's speech to text models and they are not Google they are open source they are free there is no compilation required and to top it off you can use it simply on cpu you don't need any production grade or any gpu at all you can use it with one line also they have a large library of voices they provide you an end-to-end -end pipeline and you can also enjoy some natural sounding speech they are minimalistic plus there are not many dependencies which need to be deployed also, they support for 16 kilohertz and 8 kilohertz out of the box. In this video, we are going to install it locally and then we will play around with it. Before I do that, let me say a huge thanks to Mast Compute who are sponsoring the VM and GPU for this video. As I mentioned earlier, this particular repo or project doesn't need GPU, so even if you don't have it, feel free to use it on a CPU. But as I already have the system, so I'm just going to uh, use it, but I'm going to install all the models on CPU. If you're looking to rent a GPU on good prices, I will drop the link to the website of Mast Compute in video description. Plus, I'm also going to give you a coupon code of 50% discount on a range of GPUs. This is Ubuntu system which I'm going to use. And this is my GPU card NVIDIA RTX A6000 with 48 GPU of VRAM courtesy masked compute let me clear the screen let's first install a virtual environment with conda i'm just calling it cell let's wait for it to get installed shouldn't take too long to get installed and activated that is done next up let's install torch torch audio and omega Kona. all of these are required in order to get this working so let's wait for these to get installed this is going to take a minute or so so let's wait the prerequisites are done let me clear the screen next up let's git clone the repo of this ciliero and i'm going to also put the link to it in video description okay so and that is done it is quite quick let's clear the screen now next up let's also install our jupyter notebook and ip widgets and we are going to launch it in the browser so that we could play around with this in the browser environment. So let's wait for it to get launched. So the Jupyter Notebook is launched. Next up, let's import the libraries which we have installed, which include a lot of stuff like Torch, Torch Audio, and Glob or Glob for handling with the paths and file names. And then we are just getting some utility from Cilioris GitHub repo, which we have just cloned. Then we are using our device as CPU. If you are, want to use it on GPU, just put GPU here. But it, these are very lightweight stuff. It runs fine on CPU, so I'm going to use that. And the Ciliero models, I'm just going to go with speech to text. Also, another thing is that Ciliero models don't support many languages, but just English, Spanish, Russian, and German. But I think you can extend it if you want to because it's all open source. So let me run it. So you can see that it is downloading the model at the moment and we are doing speech to text so what it means is that we just will be providing it a audio file maybe in wave or mp3 format and then it is going to convert it into speech so let's wait for it to download that model the model we are using it is just in time x large with this ciliero speech to text or stt and the model is downloaded and now let's do the speech to text so in this code chunk all we are doing it we are downloading this wave file you can provide it any wave file from your local system or any other from url if you like it is just storing it here and then this wave file is being used the glob is just to make sure that all the files with these names are find, uh, found on this current working directory it is splitting it into batches it is preparing the input for the model model is um, doing the speech to text and then we are printing it out after decoding it 
and there you go you can see that now it has done the speech to text it has transcribed that audio and it was fairly quick all on cpu as you can see that example.cpu and it has done the perfect transcription of that small audio file so this was the example of speech to text where we gave it an audio file and it gave us the text from that audio Cilioro models also support text to speech where we just give it a text in those four languages and then it converts it into speech or audio file let me also show you and it's all again on cpu so first up again let's import the libraries and then these are the model files which contains the model information information in yaml file let me run it that is done so this has just downloaded the model information if you want to list that which models are available for your text to speech or TTS let me print them and that is going to show you that these are the models available in Russian English German Spanish French and various other languages including some of the Indic languages and then these are the available model as you can see version 3 version 4 and all that stuff now let's try to maybe we'll go with the Russian one for this one and I will just go with the Russian model and then yeah and I mean AA model here so I'm just using the language Russian version 4 and we are using CPU let's download the model it is going to take a bit of a time but it's very lightweight you see it's already done and if you have GPU just put it on GPU you can also display that what sort of speaker this model has been trained on so you see we have these voices Xenia, Eugene, Nader and few others and now you can simply create an audio with the help of this model from the text so this is some Russian text which I have grabbed and it is going to use this uh, model text to speech to create that audio file and then it, we are going to run it so let me run it doesn't should not take too long it is all running on CPU there you go you see how quick that is let me play it Okay, so if you're a Russian speaker, please let us know if it is correct or not. But other than that, the real point is that it is so easy, so fast to do both STT and TTS with the Ciliaro models. And these are uh, production grade, enterprise grade model. You can use them in your project and all that stuff. Also, um, for the licensing, you can see that it is CC by NC, which is not as liberal as Apache 2. So make sure that you are aware of its nuances if you are looking to use it in some commercial and other stuff. And I will leave that to you. But And I will drop the link to this repo in video description. Let me know what you think. If you like the content, please consider subscribing to the channel. If you are already subscribed, please share it among your network as it helps a lot. Thank you for watching.